Hey Air Signs and welcome to my channel. This is your Monday, October 1st um, daily love reading for you, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus Air Signs, <coughs> which is Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. Alright, we are ready. All right, your guys' overarching energy. Oh, nice. Is the fool. Brand new beginning, starting out fresh, um, clean slate, clarified by the eight of pentacles and the lovers. Wow. And the moon is the next card under that with the devil. Wow. Lots of big changes for you guys, air signs. All right, so all of you are dealing with the choice of uh, giving this person a second chance or um, taking a leap of faith with somebody new. Um, for you guys, you have two people you have to choose from or this is your person. One of them has not done the work that's needed to um, move forward, though, just quite yet. But it is here. I mean, it is here for you guys. Gemini, you have the Nine of Cups in reverse. Could be dealing with a Scorpio because they have that as well. Libra, you guys have the Six of Wands in the upright. And Aquarius, the Five of Swords in reverse. Okay. So, um, Gemini, you guys, um, you were hoping for a new beginning with somebody to start a new chapter. Um, but there, the, your person has a choice to make. Um, and it's not even between two people. It's between work and love. Let's see here. Oops. Gemini males. All right. That was quick. Gemini females. That was quick too. Thank you, spirit. All right. So <clears throat> Gemini males, you guys have been holding back, um, been kind of stingy with your time, greedy with your own time, not really um, giving to this relationship fully. Um, so now you're being faced with the um, situation that they might not choose you uh, because you haven't expressed your feelings. You haven't told this person exactly how you feel, how much you care about them, how much you want to start a life with them. So they, um, you may be faced with them choosing to move forward, um, by themselves. Gemini females, you guys look amazing. You guys have, um, worked very hard at finding balance and self-healing. However, there is patience that is, um, a lesson that, that needs to be learned here. Um, your prayers aren't being answered yet. Um, they will be though, because you are working very hard on yourself. You are going to get a new beginning. They are going to choose you, but right now you need to continue to do a little more work before, um, before this person can come back or somebody new can come into your life, but you are doing an amazing job, um, to this point, keep working on healing, um, keep doing your meditations and your self, uh, love affirmations that is very important because archangel michael is uh watching over this relationship and it is blessed by the angels so you will find success in this awesome for you gemini females all right libra men libra you guys are finding success moving on into the future oh my goodness look at that the fool as well libra females thank you all right Wow. All right, Libra men, most definitely you have a new beginning. You're taking a leap of faith and you're going to find much success in it. Um, just be careful of the getting um, like too big of a head. I see a lot of like self boasting here, like, um, like self confidence to the extreme, but that's okay. Um, you should be proud of yourselves, but either way, you guys are getting a fresh brand new start. You're taking that leap. You're deciding to go for it. And, um, and you're going to find much success could be dealing with an Aries or a Gemini as well. Um, yeah, you guys are just, you guys are going to come into some money as well. Um, right now there's a delay though, but there's some kind of money coming in for you Libra men that is unexpected. Libra females, you guys have to be patient. You're the person that is emotionally, um, your match is coming for you or you to them, but you um, have to be patient and, and put in a little more work. 
You have the Seven of Pentacles, but the Eight of Pentacles is in reverse. So there's still a little work to be done. But um, they're going to come and make an offer to you um, and let you know that that this is, um, you are the person for them. This relationship is going to be very successful um, as long as you put in the work. Within the next week, you'll hear from this water sign about um, taking this leap of faith to move forward, um, throw caution to the wind, and you guys find success. Aquarius men. Aquarius females. All right. So Aquarius men, um, there's some things being hidden. Um, and you're refusing to walk away from somebody. Uh, this person could have uh, a connection to source. But there's, there's just a lot of secrecy going on here. Um, you're refusing to walk away in hopes of a new beginning, but this, this relationship, um, this, for this group of people is not going to work out because there's too much secrecy. If you want it to work, if you want this new beginning, you have to come forthright with, uh, your feelings, your thoughts, your wants, your needs. Um, and once you do that, then this will be repairable. But as long as you are keeping how you feel a secret, you're not going to get that new beginning. Aquarius females, you guys are transfer, transforming into um, who you know you're meant to be. This is a new beginning for you. This is beautiful um, because you're going to leave all that you lost behind you. You're going to take this leap of faith and you're going to choose to love yourself. You're going to choose to um, move forward and... And just no longer let everyone's opinions be in the back of your head. Um, for a long time, you've held on. For a long time, you refuse to give up. But it is time now to move forward and to um, into a position that you know you're meant to be in. And you will get the new beginning as well. Um, but you are currently going through a transformation. So it's going to feel really hard. It's going to feel... Um, it's, there's just going to be a lot of shedding of the old you going on, but you will be successful. Your guys' advice card for Monday is the arrow master hitting the mark, intention, and discernment. So, um, for any of you wondering, these cards are uh, hidden or wisdom of the hidden realms by Colette Barrett Reed. I love these cards; they're beautiful. Okay, so um, the arrow master appears to help you target your intentions and teach you how to shoot straight for the stars. The message is to be deliberate about focusing your dreams and desires with intention and about aligning your intention with spirit. Then let them fly on the wind, directed by the divine until they reach your goal. The only way to hit the target is to allow the arrow of your intention to fly uncumbered by your eagerness to see it travel exactly the way you want it to go. You may think it needs to veer in a certain way to reach your goal, but the inevitable run but in the invisible realms, human power cannot make this happen. The divine has its own idea of how the arrow flies and upon what wind it's carried. Nonetheless, you don't shoot, you'll score. This is a fortunate message as long as you remember the law of detachment. If you do, then you'll be assured to hit the right point. So set your intentions. Um, don't set your expectations about how, when, where, why, or what. Set your intention of what you want and let the divine take it from there. They will bring you your um, what you're trying to manifest uh, as long as you detach from the outcome. Allow whatever the universe has in store to bring it towards you. And when you are able to detach from the outcome, your intention will be met. So, all right, guys, I hope you have a wonderful Monday. As always, I wish you love, light, and God bless.